So we're going to solve this problem and find the intersection points so we can find the enclosed area. After solving this, um, we find negative 1 and 1 are the intersection points. You would just set x squared is equal to 2 over quantity x squared plus 1. And, um, well, either trial and error or you can go through a lot of effort and uh, multiply us all out even though it's kind of a pain but um, plugging a negative 1 squared is equal to 2 over negative 1 squared plus 1 is equal to 1 is equal to 2 over 2 which is correct and for 1 it's the same thing so okay intersection points but the hard part mostly is integrating this so that's what I'm gonna do that's what I'm here for all right, so um, integration of this is uh, the top. We're subtracting the bottom from the top, so this is the areas. Excuse me, the area here is going to be equal to from negative one to one of two over x squared plus one minus x squared dx, which is going to be equal to two quantity zero to one. We're just going to take half of this because it would nullify it. Um, because if, if you subtract, if you add them both up, you'll get a ne you'll get the equivalent negative on the left side as you do for the right, and it just cancels it out. So zero to one. Um, so again, it's the same thing: x squared plus one minus x squared dx. So integrated, this is two times. An arc tangent x of negative one third or minus one third x cubed zero to one, um, which is equal to two times two times pi over four minus one third is equal to pi minus two thirds. That's exact answer or the approximate answer is around like two point four seven. Okay, either one. There, there you go. That's it.